All right, I just walked in the door right here. We have the panel right here. Everything's flip switch, um, which is no computer screen ones, which is very easy to manage. This is very rare. I love this in fifth wheels when they have it because it's where you hang your jackets. This has, you can put like your shoes in here, sit down, your bench. This even could be a little workstation if you want with a little stool. It's a big drawer. USB port up there, nice cabinets there's the backup camera if you didn't have this it's like eight hundred dollars for the set so that is a nice value to have that seems like rvs everything costs so much this is a cute little set it looks like there's two chairs here that match and this one random one so when i bought my fifth wheel same thing um the blinds are accordion they're super cute i like the little finish up here nice little touches they have with these lamps sconces furniture is in great condition it's like super soft um Leather and they match, which is super nice. So this guy would be a pull-out bed. Let's see. Yeah, it's a trifold. So this would come out three times. Pretty nice, not an air bed, but you do have storage up top, lots of flip lights. Um, let's see. This fireplace is super cute. Nice TV here. It says it's a Samsung, so I would assume it's a smart TV, but I can look at the remotes. This is an awesome stereo system. Nowadays, they're so tiny, they don't give you a lot of options, but I like this, it's easy to see. So volume, turn, track, you got your Bluetooth, CD, DVD. So everything's right here. So it's already hooked up to your TV, so you don't need extra stuff. Um, let's see here. You have Corian counters, adjustable shelving in the pantry. This is a nice glass door right here. And these are deep drawers. Like this is my hand. So like a spatula or something long will fit in there. Those are very nice. And then down here, all this is open. So you can do a big, nice trash can. You're not fighting to have it at the end of the counter here. Two piece sink looks like. So rinsing and drying. This is again a Corian. And then as you come over here, nice deep storage for pantries again. Um, the microwave is a little smaller, but you know, when you're, it'll get the job done. I would say like bag of popcorn, warm up a plate, three burner propane stove and the oven. It's not massive, but you can still do like a cookie sheet for baking. This one had some racks or spices in there. It looks like they're pretty deep. I would guess them at least a foot, foot and five inches fridge wise. Um, this is just a little freezer propane or electric yeah this is the eight cubic fridge so it's bigger than the normal six let's see what's in here so you got some more shelves put like shoes in there or something just to kind of get them out of the way oh uh, let's see here as you come up here you're gonna have it has some type of solar on top i'm just not sure the ampage that's the only thing because it was aftermarket um and this is your remote for your awning and things like that this is your uh, air conditioning system and it looks like heat so right here you go straight into the bedroom there's a window in the hallway so right now there's no lights on just so everyone can see um this is a cute little bathroom it has this has to open yeah okay nice little medicine cabinet i love my medicine cabinet in my trailer let's see if i can do this with one hand now here's the gimme. I'm only 5'3", five 5'4". Five this is not the tallest shower, but I would say like a six foot person is easily going to be able to go in there. So everything looks good there. And during the walkthrough, this RV tech will show you water working, hot water, all that. So storage for this comes out again, long ways. They're slow clothes. So these would be great for towels. This is a sliding door. You do have a furnace in here. This is a ceramic toilet and has the stool. This is two shelves, but it does have, this one has a fan up top here. It's not one of those fancy fans, but it'll turn on and off. So, and I'll have them wash the top of that. I really like this wallpaper though. That's really nice. So in here we have a queen bed. It looks like that's a nice mattress. Very nice. 
but you could go king it looks like possibly up top an rb king i can measure that if you really want to know but this has a closet bar in there a lot of storage in this guy for how small it is big drawers another one for shoes or underwear socks you can never have too much storage more storage in there I like the nightstands, how they're low, so you can put like water bottles, charge your phone, little reading lights. TV is already installed in here. That was definitely aftermarket, and that's a Furion, so it's probably that. This, I'm not sure what happened. I bet you, I'm not sure, but if I were you, I'd just do like a fancy like sign from Hobby Lobby or something cool. This has, oh, charging station, so USB ports and that. Let me see if I can lift this bed. Ugh, it's heavy, but there it does lift up. And, yeah. So this is where your second air conditioner would be, it seems. It's just, uh, does it have a second air conditioner? If you want a second air conditioner, they're probably close to about $1,800. But one thing I want to mention is, this is a, um like a ducted system, so you don't have the actual AC unit blowing down, which means it's gonna be quieter. So it's like to mention that, that's a higher class thing that they do. So, anywho, I'd love to show this to you in person. Let me know if you want me to plug it in so you can see it.